Howdy, y'all. It's me, Eric. I'm out here in Little Rock channeling my inner cowboy. I got my do and I got my blue. And today I'm talking about Burger King. It's kind of fun being a redneck. I like this hat. I got it at the gas station for $20. I think it fits me perfectly. I didn't realize my head was so small. Why I got such a tiny little head? There might be a little dust on the bottle. But you should still drink it cause something's inside. So today I'm doing stupid Burger King reviews and I'm gonna wear my hat cause I like it. And I think it makes me look like a sheriff. Take 10 paces, you yellow bellied liver little freak. Okay, so this is for the Junior Bacon King sandwich. This girl put, wherever this is, we must find it. Wherever this is, I'll find it. If I have to climb the highest mountain and swim in the deepest sea, it's at Burger King, doofus. I heard it was last spotted in the lost city of Atlantis. I'm saddened the mushroom Swiss has left us. Can you be a little more dramatic about this sandwich? It sounds like you're reading a eulogy at a funeral. I am saddened. Jesus is eating it now. Dipping his onion rings in the clouds. I'm so sad. <laughs> Why did you leave us mushroom Swiss? Without you, my life is a meaningless pile of shit. This girl put down, who the fuck follows Burger King? That's a good point, but you're still commenting on their Instagram page. That's like walking into Walmart, like, man, who shops here? Look at these losers. Like, hey, you're in the Walmart. You're commenting on their page. You're part of the problem, dipshit. Phoenix4557, which sounds like a bad Steven Seagal movie, put, I want to eat it real hard. Are you saying you're like starving and you're going to shovel it in your mouth? Or are you gonna eat it like hard like a gangster? What you know about the BK bitch? I'll bust a fucking onion ring in your bitch ass, motherfucker. This guy, I guess, went to the chain in Staten Island. They refused to participate in the Halloween Whopper giveaway, despite my clown costume. I guess he was there on Halloween. I went into Burger King dressed like a clown, and they wouldn't even give me a free dollar cheeseburger. But that wasn't embarrassing enough, so I decided to write a novel about it on your Instagram's page. This is from a weed dispensary in California. Tag your buds, munchies. At least you know your target audience. Business has just quadrupled. Hey, I wrote about you on the Burger King page. Y'all got Burger King in here? Here is Pennywise holding the Burger King burger. No! No! Pennywise! No! I ain't going! Hey, kids! Want a Big King sandwich? <laughs> they float! Down here, they all float! I think I'm going to McDonald's. This ad just made me soil my pants out of sheer terror. This guy put, I can't find it in Las Vegas, Nevada. Dude, you're in Las Vegas, and you're looking for Burger King? I flew all the way here from Milwaukee to get the chicken fries. I have no interest in gambling or any other salacious activities. You want a hooker? Does she come with fries? Last time I got a burger here, it looked like someone stepped on it. Burger King, can you please explain? Yes, someone stepped on it. Come again. Hey, Burger King. Hey, Burger King. Just a little announcement, but I'm for real gonna bring food from McDonald's inside your dumb Unking building. Fuck off, Burger Burglar King shit. McDonald's slay ass. Okay, if you're gonna give someone a written threat, you really might wanna know how to spell. Me mad? You dead? Onion rings everywhere. Blood, fries, devastation. Burger King not healthy. But it's the closest to my home, so I will buy it every day. You lazy fuck. Tom, you're 600 pounds. 
Burger King's the only place I can get to. I can't even fit in the car. I literally have to roll down the hill to the drive through Then the ambulance has to bring me back after I've done my Hershey's pie.